what's good everybody so today we're just going to jump right into today's video here is my nighttime routine as you can see i do start it off with a dr teal's foaming bath it does contain epsom salt this type is the soothe and comfort type and when i tell you guys it smells amazing definitely feel like you're in a luxurious spa or something like that so i'm just going to follow it up with some dr teal's epsom salt this is the same type the soothing comfort it basically contains magnesium sulfate which is known to revitalize tired achy muscles and refreshes your skin appearance definitely fills with luxurious oils it does soothe your senses and provides relief from stress so i just like to sit down and really take it in let it you know go all over my body and all through my nose and just you know woosah a little bit i do this specific routine at least once or twice a week or definitely when i'm shaving you know i just really want to relax so now i'm going to go in with my shea moisture african black soap it does contain shane butter it's a face and body bar it's designed to cleanse hydrate and calm problem skin so if you guys have like any black spots or any uneven skin you should definitely use this i grabbed my body sponge it's for exfoliating but i also use it for this because it does give it like a really good lather and i'm able to like really go deep into my skin and into my pores with this sponge next i'm going to grab my equate tropical mango shea sugar scrub oh my god you guys this smells so good it's an exfoliating body scrub it removes dull dry skin it does have a very glowing soft effect after your skin is a hundred times smoother it's made with pure shea butter and sugar to soften and moisturize your skin so you could use this regularly it has a great texture and when i tell you guys it smells so good it smells so good next i'm going to start my shower i'm going to rinse all of that body scrub off and i'm also going to wet my hair and prep it for my shampoo today i'll be using the cantu shampoo it is also made with shea butter and essential oils it does replace vital oils in your hair leaving it stronger healthier with a natural shine so whether you have a perm whether you have you know any color or your hair is pressed the Cantu Shea Butter Moisturizing Cream Shampoo is gentle enough to use on an everyday basis. Especially if you have long hair, you really, really need to get a very good lather in your hair. I wash my hair at least twice with the shampoo before I move on to the conditioner. And before I put any conditioner in my hair, I do make sure that all of the shampoo is completely out. For the conditioner today, I'm using the Cantu Shea Butter Moisturizing Rinse Out Conditioner. I cannot emphasize enough how good this conditioner works on my hair. Like, I, it doesn't matter how many times I shampoo my hair, my hair gets naughty. This conditioner definitely moisturizes my hair and I can literally comb right through it without having lots of breakage and damage. Don't mind that little piece of hair that's at the bottom. Of my, oh my God, when I saw this video, I was like, I have OCD so bad, I just want to go in there and grab it. Like, ew, I hate that. <laughs> but don't you guys like my little flowers for aesthetics? I thought it was super cute. You know, today, since we're going with like a mango vibe and shea butter vibe, I was like, let's just try to make it look kind of tropical. So I hope you guys appreciated that. So I'm just going to let that sit in my hair for a couple of minutes. In the meantime, I'm going to move on next and begin to shave my legs. Today we're using the Cremo Shaving Cream. When I tell you guys, this is the best shaving cream that I've ever used. I mean, like, it will have your legs super slick. It's a very high quality shaving cream. You can also use it to shave down there. It works great on your bikini area and it does also provide like an invigorating cooling sensation so <laughs> you know 
but all in all it is very slick so the razor that I have here today is a Venus razor for sensitive skin but with that razor and this moisturizing shaving cream I like had to hold down <laughs> with the razor really hard because as you can see it's like I'm sliding all over the place it's so such a slick feeling So now that that's over, I'm just going to rinse that off. I'm going to comb through my hair, get all the little knots and tangles out. And like I said before, as you can see, I'm combing very easily through my hair without any issues. Moving on, I am going to apply my Cantu Shea Butter Leave-In Conditioner. You can apply this conditioner to your split ends like every day or your damaged areas every day you're just going to wet your hair a little bit comb through and let it dry also it does repair your hair and promote strong long and healthy hair i really like this for my hair in particular because i don't like washing my hair every day but it does keep my hair very moisturized throughout the week This Dove Mango and Almond Butter Body Wash, girl, when I tell you, it smells so good. I'm talking about so good. And it feels so good on my skin. It has mango butters, almond butters. Oh my goodness, just butter, just butter, baby. I thought it would be cute to keep this little theme going. So today I am going to use the Crushed Almond and Mango Butter exfoliating body polish by Dove and oh my god it smells so good like I know I keep saying that but you guys have to buy all everything everything that I've used here today you have to buy it's so creamy it's so rich um, it does provide exfoliation to buff away your dull skin it's filled with juicy mango and creamy almond scents and it also provides instant skin softness and lasting smoothness and after I just shaved, baby, I am a slick. You see, I used a little bit and look at all that, that, that coverage. Like, I am ready to like slide in a nigga mouth. You know, <laughs> I'm just kidding, I'm just kidding. But no, I'm so serious. You guys, I did not want to get out of the shower, but I was like, let me get my ass up because I have other things to do, okay? So, I use Dove for my deodorant. This spray deodorant is the only deodorant that I can use that works. It's dry. It does not lint all over your clothes. As you can see, I have on black, and it still works perfectly fine. Here is my Equate toothbrush. It has multi-purpose use. You can take the toothbrush head off and replace it with a floss pick. It does come with the toothbrush. You can buy it um, together in the pack. You can go ahead and floss your teeth. When you're done flossing your teeth, you take that pick off and put your toothbrush back on. let's not forget to like comment and subscribe okay don't play with me definitely like comment and subscribe i appreciate to everyone who takes the time out to watch my videos i love you guys so much and it also has replacement floss picks as well like you're not going to use the same exact one but and you can also use like the little toothpicks it comes with I highly recommend yeah I might think I'm crazy but this is what I wash my face with it's a carrot complexion soap I literally bought this at the hair store and I've had it for a year well I've been using this for at least a year when I tell y'all this is the only thing that works for my face does not break me out it's not oily your face will literally be 
clean squeaky clean when you're done with this i just take my little loofah and scrub it all over my face girl this works i don't care about any aveno products anything this works for me it brightens my face and i have super sensitive skin i mean super sensitive skin and it still works like trust me you just have to try it don't mind my little ghetto moment here usually i dry my face with these little face napkins or like a fresh washcloth but my daughter's outside my bathroom door and if i go out there like i can't get any of this done so i can't let her see me so i'm just using my towel <laughs> so i'm going to skip this part today but if you guys are breaking out really bad or you have really bad acne i definitely recommend this dr dennis Gross alpha beta extra strength face peel basically it's little pads you'll rub it all over your face this one is extra strength it's very strong it has two steps as you can see one and two but definitely look more into it you can google it and these are very expensive now i'm just going in with my thayer's witch hazel facial toner it basically cleanses tones and moisturizes your skin all at once with the help of rose water or you can buy the unscented brand me preferably i do have the unscented brand and then i'm just going to go in right after with my murad moisturizer and I told you guys last video that I was going to tell you how this was working for me and it's working perfectly fine. Highly recommend. I'm going to follow up with that with my vitamins and C beauty, dead sea minerals and vitamin C complex. It is a skin toning serum, very rich. I would recommend you use just a few drops. A few drops does take you a long way. You're just going to place that on your face and massage that very evenly around your face and also you can use it on your throat or your chin lower cheeks Next, I'm going to use my Tree Hut Sugar Lip Scrub. And if you want your lips to be soft and kissable, use a lip scrub, honey. Some of y'all lips put the crack in crackhead. Okay, baby? You cannot lick your lips to get this effect. Use a lip scrub. Just scrub it, scrub it, scrub it, scrub it in. And I promise you, your lips are going to be so soft and smooth. Next, we have a Jamaican mango and lime black castor oil. It does include argan oil. And baby, <laughs> it works good on these edges, okay? I've been using it for a while. But definitely, I love applying it to my edges. My edges are, are like disappearing. Like, baby, where is you going? Like, after I had my daughter, my pregnancy hair fell out. And it was like, no, that's not what we doing. We need to bring it on back, okay? Bring y'all back out of retirement. So I just place that everywhere where my hair is super thin. Um, but especially like on my roots. I don't place it like on the ends of my hair or anything. Just the roots and my scalp. And I just like to massage that in. After I do that, I just put a little bit more of that leave-in conditioner in my hair. Just to make sure that... I apply it evenly all throughout my hair. I just put like a little handful and then I add lots of water just to smooth it out. You could copy that like it's easy. You look like you need proper. Come get this vitamin D power. Be ready to touch when I reach it. I go eat it up by no reason. I make that thing go wild. I go make that thing run water. I go make you sing my song. There's a meeting in my and if i'm trying to go to bed looking really sexy then i'll just put the cantu wave with curling mousse in my hair just to apply like those curls you know my hair is naturally curly but i do get it blow dried and straightened so much and i wear my hair straightened so i just try to keep like that natural look 
every now and then i don't want you know my hair to just become permanently permanently straight and lose like all of its bounce and all of its curls so i do apply curling products just to you know remind my hair like baby we straight on some days but don't forget where you came from okay so i apply that evenly throughout my hair and i just scrunch my hair up just to bring those curls back and have them pop in this murray's edge wax extreme hole works so good for my edges as you can see my hair is completely wet not super wet but very damp and it still lays your edges to the gods okay baby and of course you know you got to do it with the toothbrush because who needs the edge brush like we from the hood over here, okay? You know what I'm saying? We a little bougetto. But crack that toothbrush out, put that edge wax on, and lay down the Michael Jackson edges. Don't you dare walk out that bathroom without putting some mouthwash in your mouth, okay? As you see, it says intense because, you know, sometimes breath be a little intense. Don't you dare go up in that man's face with that hot ass breath. Put some damn mouthwash in your mouth, baby, okay? my girls that know what's tea you already know why i'm taking these specific vitamins but these are the vitamins that i do take every night this lotion right here changed my life this hemp lotion changed my life i'm not gonna lie it did cost about 20 dollars for this specific bottle but it smells so good it's so rich so creamy i'm not even lying i swear to god i highly 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 recommend this lotion very very moisturizing very creamy just full of substance it's not watery nothing it's worth every penny <laughs> Lastly, I like to follow that up with a little bit of bio oil. Bio oil is so good for your skin. It does improve the appearance of new or old scars. I did used to put this on my incisions when I got my BBL. Um, it does also help the appearance of burns, insect bites, scratches, co any conditions like if you have like acne marks or anything like that. So I like to just put it all over my legs because, you know, your legs is like one of the first things that a man looks at. And so you gotta have sexy legs, okay? Don't mind, don't mind my little skinny legs, but it's all good. I'ma get thick, I'm on my get thick program. <laughs> but that's basically it. After that, I just like to chill and relax and watch TV and catch up on everything. So I hope you guys enjoyed my video. Like I said, all of these products that I use today, I highly recommend. I would not advise anyone to do anything that I'm not doing. But I have like 10 minutes left until my terrible one-year-old or my three boys come busting through the store. So I will see you guys next time. Thank you. Mwah. Never, never said, never, never said, never.